Build and Rural Life magazine. We're here at Watson Brothers, City of London. Great pleasure meeting up with Michael Luca. Morning, Michael. Morning, John. Thank you very much indeed for inviting us up. Well, Michael, how did you get involved in the gun industry? Well, simple really, John. I always had an interest in guns. Yeah. And um, I got an apprenticeship with Purdy's. I was very lucky to get that. And I had a fantastic teacher there called David Symes, who's my gaffer. Oh, right. Taught me all, all I knew about, all I know about barrel making. Um, continued through and learned action in there as well. Left in 1985 and was freelance for the trade. Oh, right. Um, built guns for the trade as well. And obviously, whilst doing all that, had customers interested in me building guns for them. Yeah. Um, the other funny fact was I had gun orders which I was building without having a name to put on the guns How because they actually told me they didn't want my name on the guns. Oh really? Originally, yeah. So I bought the Watson name because it was famous for making small bore guns, which is what predominantly people wanted. Oh right. Now, so when did they when when did they uh, slow down their production or, or when did it halt? Well, Watson's originally stopped producing about around 1930. But then they became Hellis Beasley Watson later on in life, All right. and that's where I purchased the name. But right. they hadn't really manufactured since the 30s. So come on, then. what was the first gun you made under the Watson banner? First gun I made was a 20 bore sub side, um, single trigger, 28 inch barrel, and I still own it. 